a little bit of people the internet. It's been a while. Um, I've come back to say that our hiatus will be ending pretty soon. And I know technically I haven't really gone anywhere because I've still been streaming, but you know, um, normal uploads, I should say, will be resuming again soon. My plan is, is I want to finish the things that I've started, such as Changed, Resident Evil 2, Celeste, Persona 4, but maybe not the re-edited series. We might want to just focus on the new stuff um, because re-edits take a lot of work. We have to clean up the audio and all that. Being a robber, for example, I had originally planned to have that replace the original series, but since it's we might not possibly finish it, I figured I might as well re-list the original playlist of the, the, the original videos because um, I had delisted it with the intention of having the re-edits just replace straight up replace it but the re-edits are going to be put on a pause probably i don't know maybe we could make it like a patreon exclusive if we ever uh get enough patreons which by the way i'll the patreon's in the description if you want to support us on patreon um that would be really appreciated and then, who knows maybe maybe in the future we will have stuff like uh the re-edited that will go on patreon first i would say change is uh along the lines of what i'm going to be going for in the future um, stuff like Celeste and Persona, eh, Persona kind of has some furry elements like with Teddy, but we're, we're going to be mostly focusing on furry centric games. I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos from like channel makers and vidIQ and whatnot about like how to grow your channel. And one thing that keeps coming up is to niche down, to really find the niche. And I think it's pretty obvious that our niche is furry stuff. I mean, I'm a furry gaming channel. Um, I kind of always thought that I didn't necessarily need to focus on the furry aspect. It could be just more like the mascots, you know, like, a, yeah, we are furries and yeah, I use the furries for the thumbnails, but we're still just, you know, regular, a uh, regular Let's Play channel. We just happen to use furry elements, but uh, if the change videos have anything to go by and all the change shorts that I've been uploading too, always getting the most numbers out of anything, uh, it tells me that the my, uh, my audience specifically is really into the furry shit. <laughs> I mean, that seems obvious when you think about it. Like, right, like we're duh, we're furries. Obviously we should do more furry things. I just, it, I didn't really think about it before. I just wanted to be like a let's player who happened to be a furry. But I really think we should, we should niche down and really focus on the furry shit. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to be doing. All the games going forward are going to be furry centric. Um, we're going like, we, to finish Changed. We're probably going to do Overgrowth at some point. Um, I should do a re a uh, visit of the Dust game, Dust the An Elysian Tale. I think that would probably be a good thing to go back to. We still need to redo Night in the Woods because I've I completely uh, privatized the our, our Night in the Woods playthrough because it had, unfortunately, someone I no longer associate with in it and I didn't want him to be associated with my channel anymore. So everything that he was in, I ha I just made private because I didn't want him on my channel. That really sucks because Night in the Woods is a really good game. So we gotta revisit that game too. I gotta get, I we put that on the channel. Um, so, you know, Night in the Woods, Dust, Changed, Overgrowth. We'll find more furry games. There's plenty out there. I'm positive of it. Melody gifted me this game called Grapple Dog. I could probably do that as a furry game. Fur Quest uh, was a game that I did one stream of. <clears throat> and I think I'll actually be doing it as a let's play instead of a stream, uh, which is why I haven't done another stream of it yet. We're going to actually record it and edit it and put it up as a mainline video because it is furry focused. And plus, I kind of think it works better as a let's play anyway. Going forward, we're probably going to niche down, really niche down to furry specific games. And I think it'll be fun, actually. I, it, it actually takes a lot of pressure off of me, too, because I was always I don't really play a lot of games on my own anymore. Uh, most of the games Games I play or for the channel. Uh, the only games I really play on my own have been like Nintendo games. Like I've been, I've played Zelda as you saw. I 100%ed it um, on my own. Uh, I've been playing Pikmin 4. I've, I, you know, I played Metroid Dread. Um, that like I really am just like a Nintendo gamer. I just I don't really let's play Nintendo games because those are my games that I play in my free time. Those are my personal games. So that's kind of why you haven't been seeing a lot of the Nintendo games on the channel. Although. If I am making my if I am making my channel more furry centric, I might have to start adding Nintendo games because Nintendo makes a lot of furry games. Star Fox, a Pik Pikmin, you could technically count, I think. You know, um, Animal Crossing. I mean, come on, animals right there. 
So uh, maybe maybe I'll start adding more Nintendo games considering my new niche down I'm doing. But all that aside, I always have this constant worry in the back of my mind of I could play this on my own, but what if I want to let's play it? And if I want to what let's play it, I want to be blind to it. And so I would never actually play games on my own anymore. But if I'm niching down to furry specific games, I can actually play games on my own anymore that aren't furry games. I might make a new channel trailer to folk to be like show that I am niching down to specifically furry content. But I think most of the people that watch me anyway are, are people who are looking for that. Um, so I think it'll be good for me. I think I think it'll be good for the channel. Um, so yeah. Uh, streams though. Streams still are everything's on the table for streams. Like we can stream any game. It's it's just for the main uploads of the channel, the things that are gonna be featured everywhere, you know, like the the, the edited featured videos are gonna be the furry centric um, furry centric games. Um, we're probably still gonna try to do uh, stream highlights every once in a while, although those do take a considerable amount of editing. Um, so I don't know when we would be doing those, but I mean, you, you, my stream VODs, I know they're long, they're like hours long because of the stream, but the VODs are all on my channel if you are interested in watching those, so yeah. Um, and lastly, uh, if you are also a YouTuber or streamer or anything of the sort, um, my editor, Melody, is actually looking for work. Um, I unfortunately have not been able to pay her what she deserves because I've also been going through financial situations. You know, we all have me and her and everyone in that household that I might eventually move into uh, someday with them. But, you know. I mean, you know, we've been having like financial troubles considering all the time. So I've basically begged you guys to send money so uh, we could help them and help me with the furnace and, you know, that they had to move and all that shit. So, um, yeah, but all that aside, when I can get some sort of better income situation for myself as well, I do want to start paying her more. But in the meantime, um, she is looking for work. So if you want to hire her, she has a fiber that I will link in the description. Um, she's really good at editing. She, you know, I wish I could pay her what she deserves. And if you want to hire her, um, that would really help us both out, actually, I think, because then she could get some more money and that's some weight off of her shoulders with her financial situation. Yeah, you know, so uh, go help. Go help out Melody. Um, I mean, she's she's really good at editing really i mean if you if you watch my videos you've seen just how good she is so uh yeah um there's a cat in my background he's like adorable <laughs> anyway i'll see you guys later um and look forward to my videos coming back very soon